What is up, everybody? I hope everybody's having a great weekend. Um, happy Easter for all of those of you who celebrate Easter. Um, for those of you who are new to my channel, my name's Rachel. I am a nursing student. Um, I'm also a former college volleyball player, and I recently decided to pursue music. I um, did some musicals and plays when I was younger in grade school, um, but then once I started playing volleyball, I just kind of uh, didn't really have time to be involved with singing or music. Um, and so I just kind of focused on other things and but I've always really had a huge passion for music and um, kind of always dreamed of I guess jumping back into music in some element and um, so then I just kind of one day decided to finally do that and to create a singing YouTube channel. So uh, just for those of you who are new just a brief um, summary of what my channel is about. I am basically going to be walking you guys through the process of me improving, trying to improve my voice and working on my singing voice and just um, pretty much learning everything that I can about music. Because um, like I said, even though I've always had a passion for music and I was really involved in music when I was younger, I, um, I haven't really, I took one voice lesson a couple of years ago, but then I ended up moving to like another part of town um, and my voice coach uh, obviously couldn't come with me. <laughs> so um, I stopped taking voice lessons and then I took piano lessons for a little bit in junior high but um, just didn't really stick with it and so um, I guess in, in a sense I'm pretty new to music since it's been a really long time since I've done anything with it so I feel like I'm kind of starting over in a way. Um, so basically my channel is just going to be kind of walking you guys through that process of me trying to learn everything that I can about vocals, about singing, um, and about music. I am hoping eventually to also teach myself to play piano and to record that process through my channel as well. I don't have a ton of time for that right now because like I was saying I, I am also a nursing student um, but I will be um, I will become a nurse this December so hopefully um, once I'm done with that I will have a little bit more time you know I won't have to be studying anymore and things like that so hopefully I'll have a little bit more time to maybe do some of those other things but for now I'm just focusing on singing. I also am planning to write my own music at some point. Um, I'm hoping to do some collaborations with some other artists who do play instruments and do know how to write music because as of right now the only thing I can do as far as writing music goes is I write lyrics and I can come up with melodies but like I said I don't play an instrument so um, uh, right now I'm not able to like complete a song I guess on my own just because I don't have that music background um but i am hoping so for right now i'm just doing cover songs basically until i kind of have more time where i can carve out um time to actually write my own stuff and then like collaborate with somebody who can help me with the actual music um but yeah so for right now i'm just doing cover songs and then i'm also recording myself what i'm going to be doing is kind of recording myself going through different videos that i find on youtube about singing um so basically like it's kind of a self-taught kind of thing where I'm just basically going through YouTube trying to find any videos that I can related to singing, related to vocals, and then I'm gonna kind of, um, what I'll do sometimes for some videos is show you guys the video that I'm watching and then you can kind of walk through it with me. So like today I'm gonna be doing some vocal warm-ups and what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna have my phone on the screen so you guys can see what I'm watching and you can even like walk through the warm-ups with me if you're also a singer and you you know wanna find out some new ways to warm up your voice, feel free to follow along with me. I have another video up. So I found this vocal coach on YouTube. His name is Eric. I feel like I always say his last name wrong. I think it's Arsenault. Maybe it's Arsenault. I can't remember, but it's something like that. He's on YouTube. He's a professional vocal coach. He's really good. Um, I've watched his warm-up videos, war voice warm-up videos, and so I do have another video on my channel where I went through part one of his professional vocal warm-ups, and I just kind of like filmed myself watching his video and going through the warm-ups. So feel free to check that out if you guys want to, but today I'm going to do part two because he has another video that's just part two of, the, of his vocal warm-up, so I'm going to do that now. I also, um, just if anybody's interested, I also have a couple videos on my channel where I explain my kind of like studio setup. I actually have videos of me unboxing this microphone right here and the LED light that I have behind me because um, I realize that if I'm going to be making these videos, I want to make sure that they're a little bit more professional. Um, I am on a tight budget since I'm still in nursing school, so it's not like the, you know, the most professional equipment or anything, but 
I wanted to just have a little something to make it a little bit more professional um, on a budget. So if you guys are interested in those, I have the link to this microphone in the video where I unbox it and set it up and um, I actually filmed myself like opening it up, setting it up, getting it going, all that kind of stuff, as well as with the light. And I put the links in those videos for the equipment too, in case anybody else is interested, in case anybody else is also kind of trying to do this on a budget. Um, so with that being said, let me go ahead and I'm just going to pull up the video that we're going to go through on my phone. And again, I'm giving all the credit to Eric Arsenault or Arsenault. Go check out his channel. He's a professional vocal coach. This is only the second video I've watched of his so far, but so far I really like his stuff. Um, it definitely, when I've done his vocal warm-ups previously, um, I really liked the way it opened up my voice and everything. So I wanted, I noticed that he had a part two to the one I did before, so I wanted to check that one out. So we will watch that together today. And I apologize, my phone stand is vertical. So you're gonna see like, I guess, yeah, you're gonna see like this stuff below it, but it's okay. <laughs> Okay, perfect. So I'll go ahead and start that, and you guys can just follow along with me. Oh shoot, sorry. I just realized I had him talking on two times speed, so I'm like, let me slow that down for a second. Let's see. Here we go. Okay. What are you doing on your phone? I'm sorry, Add. I left a gentleman alone. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. scales on a liberal helps to reduce throat tension it also warms up and strengthens the upper register and it reduces vocal fatigue i like his little introduction music as you probably <laughs> guessed from the previous video or if you know from the old videos i love lip rolls a lot of voice people do why because it teaches your vocal cords and diaphragm to work kind of perfectly together if you've got a lip roll going the right way much rest assured that your body is doing the correct thing. Your body is being programmed to sing properly or healthily. Um, let's go over a couple common ways that people mess this up and rob themselves of the, of the full benefit. Number one, don't be afraid to use your fingers. If you want to put your index fingers into the hollows of your cheeks, for a lot of people it helps tremendously. Some people lift up a little bit. You want to remember though, bottom line is that the clearest sound is the best sound. So whatever helps you get a clear, solid, buh, buh, buh kind of sound. What we don't want is this. No. If you're using the letter P as in Paul, and you're just exhausting yourself, that's not, that's not what we want. We want the shoulders relaxed, or neck relaxed, shoulders. jaw as relaxed as possible. And if you feel a contraction anywhere, feel it in the lower abdomen, feel it in the side, feel it in the back maybe in the lower chest or side ribs, but basically the mid to low torso is fair game. But up here, no. So we want mid to low torso, okay. I'm allowing this to help me out. And I'm just gonna get a clear sound. So now we're gonna use this scale. Let's move. 
trying to pause it real quick. Okay, just quick disclaimer. I should have said this too in case you guys didn't watch the first one. You will feel pretty dumb when you're doing these exercises just because you sound funny, you look funny, so don't be afraid to just go for it and, um, you know, don't be afraid of looking dumb. I'm doing it with you, obviously. Um, you got to do what you got to do. You got to warm up your voice, so don't worry about how you look or if it sounds weird or, I mean, maybe go in your room and don't, like, be around other people because they might be annoyed by it or bothered by it, but um, don't be afraid to, you know, look dumb. Oh, shoot. I made the screen. All right. Sorry. Just a second. All right. Let's continue. But beyond that, this, should, this is not a pressurized thing. This should be a very easy kind of thing. Let's do another one. For a lot of you, this might seem high. <laughs> that is pretty high. About lip rolls is that exercise for exploring your upper range. So take advantage of that. Just don't try to brace yourself or get louder. Let your voice go where it wants to go. Normally, for a lot of, especially for beginner singers or untrained singers, Going from chest voice up in the head voice or, or mixed voice in the head voice might feel really difficult. Um, kind of stop that mixed voice just for a second there. <laughs> but transitioning through your registers can feel difficult, but a liberal makes it a lot easier. It takes a lot, it takes a lot of that pressure off. Allow it to. Another thing is, <laughs> you might be one of the many people for whom uh, the liberal is going to stop a lot at first. You might get. That's what was happening to me earlier. And people get frustrated really quickly. I mm -hmm. see it every time I do a workshop. They're like, I just can't do it, Eric. I just can't. No, <laughs> you can't do it now. But it doesn't mean that you're necessarily even doing anything wrong. It's just a matter of you. It's a matter of repetition. Your body will learn. You just have to keep doing it. And I'm going to show you exactly what to do in such an instance. So if you're getting, I'll just switch up the scale just for old time's sake. <laughs> to you keep it going. Start with the letter B. Uh, uh, 
Well, I did his part one of his vocal warm-ups before I filmed this, and then that was part two, so um, I feel like my voice is pretty warmed up. I'm going to drink some water, and then I'm actually going to film another cover for you guys. Um, I think I'm going to do uh, the song Point of or POV Point of View from Ariana Grande's new Positions album. And so now that my voice is all warmed up, I am going to jump on and go ahead and record that. Um, what was I going to say? Uh... Oh, feel free to give me any cover song requests in the comments. Um, I've been kind of asking my followers on Instagram, TikTok, all of that, um, to give me cover song requests, because um, I would love to, you know, if you guys have any particular songs that you want to hear. Like I said, I am going to be writing my own stuff eventually, but for right now, I'm just sticking to cover songs so that I can just practice my singing and, and work on it. And um, But yeah, so if you guys have any requests at all for songs that you would like to hear me sing. I would love to hear those in the comments. Please, please subscribe. Uh, please follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is Rach, R-A-C-H dot L-E-E-A-N. So it's Rach dot Leanne. And um, the information's in my about page for this channel too. And I'll put it in the description. But, and then my TikTok is just Rachel Leanne. So same as my YouTube name. So R-A-C-H-E-L-L-E-E-A-N. So please follow me, Instagram, TikTok, subscribe, and um, let me know in the comments what you guys want to hear, and um, I will see you in the next video as I record my cover of POV by Ariana Grande. Bye guys.